NHPC Limited, a company owned by the Government of India, was established in 1975 for the development of hydropower in the country. In India, there is a hydropower potential of 1,45,000 MW. However, only 47,000 MW of hydropower has been harnessed in the country so far. This is a testimony that there is still immense potential for hydropower development. In NHPC's journey of converting such potential into opportunities, the date 24 February 2020 emerged as a milestone when Sri A.K. Singh took over as Chairman and Managing Director of NHPC. There was an atmosphere of joy in the corporation, with Sri A.K. Singh taking over as the Chairman and Managing Director of NHPC. Sri Singh also had many dreams in his eyes as he was planning to take NHPC on a new flight of development and prosperity. सबसे अनुरोध है कि आप सारे मिलकर के जो ये काम को हम पांच बार करते हैं हर कोई सोचता है कि मैं किस फाइल को क्या लिख दूं कि दूसरे के टेबल पे चला जाए वो कल्चर को बिल्कुल बंद करना पड़ेगा और आप सब मिलके कीजिए और हम आपके साथ हैं. During this period, COVID-19 virus has broken out in China and was spreading rapidly across the world. India too could not remain untouched and on 25th March 2020, a lockdown was imposed in the country. Destiny had kept a most difficult time when Sri A.K. Singh assumed the charge of CMD. He had to go through the most challenging task of not only facing the obstacles posed by the pandemic and but also to ensure the continuous generating of electricity from NHPC's power stations. During the lockdown, Sri Singh was in constant touch with NHPC employees posted in various offices, power stations and projects through video conferencing. He kept on encouraging them and boosted their morale and was also constantly giving guidance and directions. Honorable Prime Minister of India, Sri Narendra Modi appealed to the citizens of the country to observe a 9-minute blackout at 9pm on 5th April 2020. This call presented a huge challenge in maintaining the grid balance where the role of hydropower was crucial, as it can be shut and restarted immediately. Under the able leadership of Sri A.K. Singh, NHPC handled the load of the national grid with readiness and determination. NHPC, under the leadership of Sri Singh, established COVID care centres with oxygen support facilities along with distribution of masks, sanitizers, and medical supplies. Food and other assistance were also provided to the needy. Under Sri A.K. Singh's supervision, massive vaccination campaigns were carried out for effective vaccination in fighting COVID-19 and blood donation camps were also organized so that its benefits reaches to maximum people. NHPC performed its duty of a good employer by saving lives of some employees posted in remote location and also by airlifting them to the nearest hospital when their health deteriorated seriously due to COVID-19. The construction activities of 2000 megawatt Subansiri Lower Hydroelectric Project, the country's largest under construction project, had been stopped since December 2011. Sri A.K. Singh understood the importance of this project for NHPC and for the entire country. Owing to the long term vision and dedicated efforts of Sri Singh, the concreting work of powerhouse of Subansiri Lower Project restarted on 23rd September 2020. Today, work in this ambitious project of NHPC is progressing at a good pace. Sri A.K. Singh, CMD, NHPC takes regular stock of progress of Subban Siri Lower Project by touring the project from time to time. The importance of this project for the country can be judged from the fact that Honorable Union Minister for Power and New and Renewable Energy, Sri R.K. Singh, had personally visited the project to monitor its progress. Shri Singh has instilled the belief in the entire NHPC team to aim big, which will yield excellent results. Within three years of the resumption of construction works, Subansiri Lua project is expected to be commissioned soon. It would definitely not be an exaggeration to say that Sri A.K. Singh's contribution to the project was truly exemplary and will be cherished for all time. Sri A.K. Singh was well aware that in order to secure NHPC's future, more projects needed to be added to its portfolio. For this purpose, Sri Singh strategically developed a very strong network of connections for the benefit of NHPC. From time to time, Sri Singh met the Honorable Prime Minister, Union Ministers, Chief Ministers, 
chief secretaries and secretaries of various state and union territories and apprised them about hydropower projects and the capabilities of NHPC. The result of the strategy adopted by Shri Singh was that while two and a half years ago only three projects of NHPC were under construction, today NHPC has 13 projects including those of subsidiaries under construction which include eight hydroelectric and five solar projects of 7,539 megawatt capacity. Work is moving at a fast pace at the 2,000 megawatt Subansiri Lua project, 800 megawatt Parbati 2, 500 megawatt Tista 6, 1,000 megawatt Pakaldul, 624 megawatt Kiru, 850 megawatt Ratle, 540 megawatt Quar and 120 megawatt Rangit 4. Hydroelectric projects along with 40 megawatt ground mounted solar project in Odisha, 65 megawatt Kalpi and 1000 megawatt CPSU scheme solar power projects in Gujarat, Rajasthan and Andhra Pradesh. I want to congratulate you all. Your CM Lee Sahib and your all. जो लंबे सिरे लंबे लंबे समय से अटके हुए थे हाइड्रो प्रोजेक्ट्स को आपने सब सब पर काम शुरू करवा दिया सुभानश्री पर काम प्रारंभ करा दिया और तेजी से चांद चल रहा है 2000 मेगावाट दिवांग अटका हुआ था दिवांग में जो भी हर्डल्स थे वो अब समाप्त हो चुके अब करीब 3000 मेगावाट का वो भी योजना प्रारंभ होगा अगला चैलेंज है सियांग 10000 मेगावाट बल्कि हम समझते हैं कि उससे ज्यादा होगा 15 20000 मेगावाट होगा अगला टारगेट वो है कुल मिलाकर के हमें 50,000 मेगावाट आपको जो आपके लिए लक्ष्य रखा था वो लक्ष्य है उसको करना है और ये बात सही है कि जिस गति से आप पिछले तीन वर्षों में प्रगति कर रहे हैं वो पहले कभी नहीं हुआ। NHPC has crossed several significant milestones and is steadily moving on the path of becoming a 50,000 megawatt multinational renewable energy company as per the expectation of Shri R K Singh. Honorable Union Minister of Power and New and Renewable Energy, laying a foundation stone of 850 megawatt Ratle hydroelectric project and 540 megawatt Quar hydroelectric project in Jammu and Kashmir by Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi. Signing of promoters agreement with GEDCOL for development of 500 megawatt floating solar projects on various water bodies in Odisha. Signing of MOU with Rajasthan Renewable Energy Corporation Limited and Rajasthan Urja Vikas Nigam Limited for development of 10,000 megawatt renewable energy parks projects in Rajasthan. Signing of an MOU with Damodar Valley Corporation to explore formation of joint venture company for exploring and setting up hydropower and pump storage projects. NHPC bagged 1000 megawatt capacity solar power project at a viability gap funding VGF of rupees 44.9 lakh per megawatt under CPSU scheme phase 2 tranche 3 in the e-reverse auction conducted by Ereda consent by government of Andhra Pradesh to allot seven pump storage projects of 6600 megawatt capacity through joint venture with government of Andhra Pradesh Acquisition of 1,856 megawatt Saval Coat hydroelectric project by NHPC. Signing of implementation agreement with Government of Himachal Pradesh for development of 500 megawatt Dugar hydroelectric project. NHPC's growing reputation in the market has gone beyond borders and established a strong identity for it at the international level. The efforts made by Sri A.K. Singh when he was an executive director in NHPC towards get hydroelectric projects in Nepal bore fruit when he became CMD NHPC. Under Sri A.K. Singh, NHPC signed an MOU with the Investment Board of Nepal on 18th August 2022 for the development of 750 megawatt West Sethi and 450 megawatt SR6 hydroelectric projects in Nepal. NHPC is also speeding up the construction of 1.2 km long Indo-Nepal Link Canal under the Mahakali Pact between India and Nepal at the barrage of Tanakpur Power Station in Uttarakhand. Under the leadership of Sri A.K. Singh, the projects from Nepal have cemented the reputation of NHPC at the international level and would definitely prove to be a great landmark for NHPC.
In 2022, during the tenure of AK Singh, NHPC broke its own record four times in daily power generation from its power stations. NHPC created a new all-time daily generation record by generating 127.82 million units of power on 21st August 2022. Under the leadership of Sri Singh, there were many radical changes in the working style of NHPC and the most striking example of this is the unprecedented improvement in plant availability factor. NHPC set a record of 88.19% PAF in the year 2021-22, breaking all the records in June 2022 and PAF crossed the 100% limit. A new standard of excellence has now been created and is now ingrained in NHPC's DNA. Along with increasing the business activities, Sri A.K. Singh took several policy decisions aimed at the all-round development of the company's personnel and to give due recognition to their dedication towards their work. In the very first board meeting after resuming the charge of CMD, Sri A.K. Singh infused a feeling of optimism among the employees by getting the long-pending proposal related to manpower approved by the NHPC board. Sri A.K. Singh modified the delegation of powers of NHPC and fixed accountability for work by giving more powers to the executive directors and heads of power stations and projects. This resulted in completion of work at a faster pace, which earlier used to take several months. Sri Singh has set a benchmark in the engagement of the employees with NHPC by embodying various welfare policies related to the promotion and welfare of the employees. From the year 2020 till now, NHPC has infused a new spirit among the personnel by providing 1,675 executives and 1,070 non-executives. As a result, the personnel started working with new energy which ultimately benefited NHPC. A total of 84 engineers and officers and 117 supervisors have been recruited since the year 2020 with an aim to induct new talent and providing them with a golden career in NHPC. Notably, NHPC employs Family Economic Rehabilitation Scheme was launched by Sri A.K. Singh, which demonstrates sensitivity and far-sightedness towards welfare of families of the employees. Apart from setting records in the power sector, Sri A.K. Singh has also put NHPC in the front line on the financial front. Under the leadership of Sri Singh, NHPC has achieved the highest ever profit after tax of Rs 3,538 crore in the year 2021-22 on standalone basis. With a view to honour the trust reposed by the shareholders of NHPC in the company, the highest ever dividend of Rs 1.81 per share has been paid by NHPC to the shareholders in the year 2021-22. In the year 2021-22, NHPC achieved the highest ever capex of Rs 5,166 crore. Under the able leadership of Sri A.K. Singh, NHPC set a new record in the year 2021-22 by recovering the highest ever dues from various states. As a result, the arrears of NHPC came down to its lowest level. Besides this, NHPC has secured minimum interest rate loan of Rs 3,000 crores from the market in the year 2021-22, which will meet the financial requirements of upcoming projects of NHPC. There has been a paradigm shift in the way information has been disseminated globally, resulting in the growing relevance of social media. Sri A.K. Singh understood this trend long ago and got the SOPs for social media in NHPC revised and paved the way for NHPC's achievement to reach its stakeholders in real time through social media platforms like Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube and Google. As a result of the efforts of Sri Singh, today NHPC is being followed by 2 lakh followers in social media. The able leadership and quick decision-making ability of Sri A.K. Singh, CMD NHPC has resulted in the exceptional achievements made by NHPC in the last two and a half years, making NHPC synonymous with power sector. It has always been the endeavour of Sri Singh to turn NHPC into an organisation that adopts new ideas and perspectives without being influenced by the traditional way of working. As a result of Sri A.K. Singh's unrelenting efforts, NHPC has re-established itself as a strong pillar of power sector and has instilled a positive confidence in the minds of the stakeholders of the corporation.
Today, all stakeholders are looking forward to the success of NHPC with optimism. It is a challenge for NHPC to fulfill the vision and goals that Sri Singh has set for the future of NHPC during the last two and a half years. However, it is also true that when NHPC realizes this target and reaches to glorious heights, then credit will go to Sri A.K. Singh's vision, decisions and all his effort for NHPC. Sri Singh's achievements, vision and dedication towards the corporation in a short span of last two and a half years has ascribed him the status of a legend in NHPC. NHPC will always remember Sri A.K. Singh's contribution to NHPC. All members of NHPC family wish him a healthy and happy retirement life. Unsuccessful people change their decisions out of fear of the world. Successful people change the world with their decisions.